Sorry, I haven't posted in a while. Uh, I've been working really hard in this video, putting in a lot of extra effort, and um, I'll put more about. I'll talk more about this in the end of the video. But yeah, so next week I'll be doing more uploads, and uh, yeah, so uh, I hope you guys enjoy the video because I've been working on this one for a while. So yeah, enjoy. The electron walls open. Darth Maul and Qui Gon continue their duel. We want to take fourth speed. We'll just make it through the electron walls in time. Sensing his master in danger, he jumps over the reactor shaft, kicking Darth Maul, who would fly into a wall. Obi-Wan would bring his blade down towards Maul, who would block as Qui-Gon joined the fight again. Maul force pushes Obi-Wan down the reactor shaft, but Obi-Wan held on as Maul and Qui-Gon continued to fight. Obi-Wan would jump back up. Maul kicks Qui-Gon down, and Obi-Wan fights Maul one-on-one. -on -one. He cuts Obi-Wan's blade in two and prepares to finish him off, but Qui-Gon stops him, but he is force choked thrown into a wall. Obi-Wan would start to recover as Maul got closer and closer to Qui-Gon who would force push Maul with his remaining energy as he passed Obi-Wan a saber who would cut Maul in half and Maul falls down the reactor shaft. They would return to Coruscant with Anakin. The council would agree that he should be trained as a Sith returning. The time of the Chosen One prophecy was sooner than they believed. Qui-Gon would talk to Dooku who would want to help Anakin in his training. Dooku stays in the light. Obi-Wan is knighted soon after these events occur. Darth Sidious begins his search for a new apprentice on Dathomir by telling Mother Talzin her son has perished in battle. She would tell him that this is not the truth and gives him an amulet to help find Maul. When Palpatine finds him, he returns him to Mother Talzin, wheels him, and strengthens him with the Force again. Palpatine would be impressed that he had survived his injuries and order him to kill Jedi Master Sifo Diaz to make up for his loss. Maul would do as he was told, then hire Jango Fett to be the clone template. Ten years later, just before Attack of the Clones, Qui-Gon is an old man at 70 years old. He is now on the council instead of Golden Traver. Yoda thought he should be on the council as he appreciates his views even though they often contradict his own. And Dooku as well would be on the council. But due to Qui-Gon's age, he's in a more kind state. He doesn't go on missions anymore, and he hasn't for some time. So Anakin usually goes on missions with Obi-Wan, who is a Jedi Master now. Qui-Gon's teaching have made Anakin a much different man than he was in the original timeline. He's still a brother to Obi-Wan, but he's a father figure too in Qui-Gon. Qui-Gon would be held responsible for Anakin's training. He would also have help from Obi-Wan and Dooku. Anakin is even more powerful than he was in the original timeline. Not as powerful as he was in the middle of the Clone Wars in the original timeline. Anakin had visions of his mother dying, but Qui-Gon, being more experienced than Obi-Wan, knew that these were in fact premonitions. Anakin had visions of the future. This time before it was too late, Qui-Gon brought him to Tatooine because of his visions just after they started. So Anakin saved his mother. He and Qui-Gon fought the Tuscans off, not killing them, Force pushing them and cutting their weapons. Anakin Anakin did have a somewhat strong desire to end them all. Qui-Gon sensed his anger and told him that they would not attack her or her family again because they knew the consequences. So Anakin stayed for a while as his mother healed. Anakin wanted to bring her back with him, but he knew she was with good people. When the time came to leave, he had gotten to know Owen, Cleed, and Beru. After all, they were his family now. He hugged his mother goodbye and told her that he loved her. And he would see her again and said his farewells to the rest of the family. Okay, so that's pretty much it. Sorry that it's short because I usually make longer ones, but uh, the next one will be a lot longer. This is one that I'm trying to take like more serious. Well, I mean, I take them all serious, obviously, but like I'm taking my time with this. This one, I haven't written a part two yet. This is probably going to be like four or five parts if I had to guess, you know. The next part's going to be episode two. Then there's probably going to be episode three. Maybe originals. I don't know. Well, no, episode two, three will probably be two parts. But regardless, I'm putting a lot of effort into this one. And I want to make it really good. So, you know, I'm, I'm taking my time with it. The next one will probably be released around... Um, I'll try to do one for the holiday, like, either Thanksgiving or Christmas. I mean, not on the day, but, like, around that time, you know, just, like, like something special. And then maybe for my 100th video, I'll try to do that, another one. But, anyways, thank you guys for, like, all the views on the past few videos. 
my other channel, Little Kit Kats, got literally like 2,000 views. I gained like 10 subs from that. I'm trying to like get my subs up because I keep getting hella views and it's just like, you know, one a hundredth of the subs, which is a little annoying. But uh, yeah, that's kind of how that goes a lot of the time. So yeah, a little frustrating, but you know. Okay, for this video, I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna post it tomorrow because this is supposed to be the video for my one year anniversary. That was a month ago, uh, on July 28th. Uh, so I'm gonna post this. I think I might uh, do a premiere thing, like an hour or a few before. I don't know how those work. I'm gonna try to figure it out because those seem complicated, but I don't know. But yeah, then uh, so tomorrow's 28th. And my birthday. My birthday is the day after. Then um, I'll be back with more posts. Uh, yeah, I'll do a versus soon next week, I think, and uh, maybe a few like uh, just normal videos, I'd say, and another what if. But yeah, I didn't know this video was gonna be that short, to be honest. But uh, yeah, so uh, regardless, more content coming soon. I'm gonna make another video talking about what content I'm going to post from now on, because I'm not sure if I'm going to keep up with the one versus a week and one what if a week um, per, you know, school year. But, uh, yeah, anyways, uh, see you guys. Uh, may the force be with you. Always.